Hey, what's up, everybody? Preston here with another box break. Tonight, it's 2019 Allen & Ginter Hobby Box. Very excited. Love Allen & Ginter product, products. Let's jump right into it. We won't waste any time. We'll get her cut open and start it. Uh, what are we looking for, Luke? Looking for all kinds of stuff. Uh, Rodney Mullins autograph, Harrison Ford. Then you got your usual suspects like Mike Trout. A lot of rip cards. Box topper rip cards look pretty cool. Yeah, I would really like to get a rip card. That would be awesome. Obviously, the Harrison Ford is, is the one. That's the one you want, right? Everybody yeah. wants a Harrison Ford card. Here's our, uh, can you see that? That's the box topper. What you want to do, save that for last? Yeah, that's fine. All right, how many packs and stuff? What do we got here? Eight cards per pack. 24 packs. Awesome. And then, uh, just so you know, join us here in a little bit. We got another one coming up shortly. All right. Helps the camera if I get those mostly out of frame. Preston underscore sports on Twitter. We'll post there before we go live. Give you a heads up. It's Allen and Ginter, so we're likely to see a little bit. Uh, what would you consider a little bit of weird? A couple of weird things in here. Oh yeah, plenty of these weird. these little ones. I'm just I got to do the little ones first because they fall out and scare me and luck is there's going to be a good one and I dent her up. Is that Willie Adams? Willie Chance Adams. Adams. I did that last time. Yeah. Rookie card. I love the little tiny ones. Those are cool. Drury Gonzalez. Oh, Louis Gonzalez. Excellent. He make the whole thing yet? No. Will he? He was a hell of a player. He was good. Oberst? Who's? Oberst? Robert Oberst? Professional strongman, Robert Oberst. There you go, kids. Study up on your Robert Oberst. There's going to be a quiz later. He's a burly dude. Look at that beard. The beard headband combo. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. Deion Sanders. Prime time. One of my favorite athletes of all time. If you don't know who he is, kids, give him a Google. William Tells Crossbow. Put an apple on your head. Don't don't do that. Don't be stupid. That's the last thing we need is YouTube videos of idiots shooting themselves with bows and arrows. Fran Mill Reyes up next. And then one of my favorite players as a kid, it's Paul Molitor. I was surprised. His war is a little lower than I thought it was. What what was his war? Do you remember? Uh, it was good. It was like in the high sixties or something. Was it? Yeah. Maybe I'm thinking of somebody else. Maybe I'm a jerk. I don't know what I'm talking about. That's pretty good. Salvador Perez. Ryan O'Hearn, rookie. Excellent. Willie Stargell. Get you a little closer. Rogers Hornsby. Who throws an S on the name Roger? So weird. Now, uh, while we're looking at the back of this, you see the 384 up there. What's our short prints, Luke? Yeah, that's a short print, I think. I think it started at 350, I want to say. 350 to 399, is that what it Something is? Something like that, yeah. I knew so, that. Uh, take a look. Make sure you're checking your short prints. They're not always easy to spot. We'll get you some clarification on that real quick. Ginter Greats, it's Randy Johnson. Google Randy Johnson explodes a bird. If you want to know exactly how powerful his pitches were, just an absolute beast. The Klalem language. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. It's the Lost Languages Collection. That's neat. I'm a bit of a history buff. Give it a pause there if you want to take a look. The Klalem language. Little tiny dude. It's uh, Mr. Carton with uh, 
this fancy necklace there. Brewer and podcast host Augie Carton. Yeah, 350 to 400 short prints. 350 to 400 short prints. And uh, Starlin Marte. Let's get another pack going. Oh, spoiler alert. This one, this one's a little thick. Oh, somebody out there just said that's what she said, and that's hilarious. Good job, whoever did it. <laughs> said that out loud. Give yourself some points. Sandy Koufax, possibly the best left-hander that's ever done it. Who's your favorite left-hander of all time? Put it in the comments down below. There's one of my favorites. I'm going to get that from Luke. See if I can make a trade because he's got two of those now. This box belongs to Luke. Moncada, Yoan Moncada is our tiny dude this time. D.D. De Gregorius up next. He started out in the Reds organization, I believe. Yeah. Diedrich Bader. Harrison Bader. I'm sorry. Who's Diedrich? <laughs> Diedrich Bader is, uh, I think he's a dude from. He's an actor. Yeah. He was in office space. Yeah. <laughs> there you go, uh, Philly fans. That's your boy. Bryce Harper. This is the uh, first signs one that we, I'll show you that. The baseball star signs. He is a Libra. We've gotten a few of those. They're kind of cool, especially if you're into astrology. Matt Chapman up next and JT Real Muto. A good pack for Philly fans there. Oh, a penny sleeve for Bryce Harper, huh? Nice. I do like those astrology cards. Not yeah, much into sleep. astrology myself, but they're good looking cards. Yeah, they're good cards. Allen and Ginter just always bringing the heat, always has some beautiful stuff. Here is something worth taking a look at. We pulled his regular card the other night. We decided he's all right. Uh, he created Parks and Rec or was an actor, a comedian on it some kind of writer or whatever but if you look at the border of this card you can see that it's different than our other tiny one so take a look for those there's another kind of uh short print yep we got one right here you'll note so the first one is regular regular on the back and then you got your fancy border with the regular on the back old ben schwartz there and then you have it looks regular on the front. That's a rookie card. And on the back, instead of having the regular writing, you got the Allen Ginter insignia. So keep a lookout for those. Again, not always easy to spot the short prints in this series. Luke Voigt. Willie Adams. Hudson. Davis and Paul Bunyan's axe. Chopping down treat where well, he's the one that had the ox blue. Mm -hmm. Herrera, Odebell Herrera, and Walker Bueller having a heck of a year. Bueller, Bueller. I wonder how many times he's heard that in his life. Oh my God. Yeah, that's terrible. It does. Uh, here we go. One of the most all the best all time mustaches ever. And then with the mustache mullet combo, I mean, it doesn't get any better than Dennis Eckersley. John Lester, Cubs fans. Mr. Martinez, JD Martinez, and Egg. <laughs> uh, egg. Part of the, what could it be the poultry collection or nope, just it's the world champions collection. Oh, it's the biggest egg or something? Uh, or the best egg. Hey, Stormy Webster, Kylie Jenner's newborn to the non celeb social media obsessed. What? I know. 
Hey, Stormy Webster, which I guess is Kylie Jenny's, Jenner's newborn to the non-celeb social media obsessed people like us. You're already old news. As of January, well, that was a waste of a complete sentence. Nothing to do with the card. As of January 2019, the infant's photo from the previous year was no longer the most liked in the history of Instagram, surpassed by one of an egg, just an egg, posted as an experiment by an unidentified Londoner. The pic soared past Jenner's 18 million likes to be on 30 million likes. This egg got 30 million likes, yeah, and now it's got its own baseball card. That's terrible. Terrible? That's rough. Awesome. It's a terrible story. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to agree. Now, we pulled some airliner cards, some, some aircraft cards the other night, and they're pretty sweet looking. Um, there's quite a few of them, but what we figured out is if you put them together. This is the Boeing 707. You can see the background of the sky. Apparently, well, Luke, you put a, you can put a mural together, right? Yeah, they kind of flow in together, the paintings do. And that's pretty cool. All right, you may have spotted it already laid in the background here. It's our first hit. Oh, oh come on now. Derek Rodriguez autograph. The on card with the fancy border, the tiny one. Framed autograph. Yeah, the framed autographs. They are absolutely beautiful. Take a look at the back for you, Derek Rodriguez. Congratulations! A certified autograph card, 2019 Allen and Ginter. Star pitcher of the San Francisco Giants. Derek Rodriguez. Absolutely beautiful card. What do you think, Luke? Yeah, it's nice. Nice looking card for sure. We'll make sure we get that in a penny sleeve. No, Don Mattingly. What do you think about Donnie Baseball? Underrated? Overrated? His mustache is not underrated or overrated. That's for sure. That is an underrated mustache. One of the best of all time. I mean, that... There's a question for you. Put in the comments below. Do you take the Don Mattingly mullet mustache combo or the Dennis Eckersley mullet mustache combo? Should we add a third option of John Cruck just for fun? Yeah, he's he's solid. Corey Kluber. A cool looking card there. Michael Franco. Bryce Harper's up next. AJ Hap, J A Hap, pardon me. Jorge Posada, Hall of Famer. Uh, that'd be tough. They play for New York, so they never know. You do get that New York bump. Hey, it's Joey Gallo. Outstanding young player, and that's going to be a, a short print with the fancy logo on the back. And then one of my favorites, Ricky Henderson, the Ginter Greats Collection. What was our one earlier, Randy Johnson? Yeah. Nice. I love those cards. And his warm-up jacket. Getting ready to steal some bases, no doubt. And Wilson Contreras rounds out that pack. As always, we appreciate you hanging out. Whatever you want to talk about, throw it in the old chat box. We're going to do more angry box breaks coming up soon. If you've seen those, if you haven't checked them out, those are a lot of fun. Feel free to put in the comments whatever's aggravating you in sports. We'll give you a shout out on the next video. Elvis Andrews. Vlad Guerrero Jr. rookie card. There you go. Nice. Beautiful. Give me a quick look at the back for all you Vlad Jr. fans. Penny sleeve for him. And it's Charles Martinet, or Martinet, perhaps, video game voice actor. 
He looks extremely excited to be getting his picture taken for the Alan and Ginter collection. I would, too. Let's see if he's worked on anything good. Who is the voice of Nintendo legend Mario? It's a Martinette. That's what it says. Sorry, that was horrible. That's just one of more than 200 video games. Uh, yeah. Awesome. All kinds of stuff. The voice of Mario right there. That's pretty cool, actually. Who doesn't love Mario games? Ozzy Smith, who's better, him or Barry Larkin? Put it in the chat box. If you answer Ozzy Smith, you're wrong. The first tiger mask. Is this a luchador? Yeah, it's like old school Japan. Oh, Mexican yes. luchador. I don't know. Professional wrestler. Six wrestlers have adopted the tiger mask since the famous Japanese wrestling character debuted it in the early 80s. Your Japanese first tiger mask wrestling card. He signs autographs. Does he? Yeah, he's got autographs. They go for a decent amount on eBay. Nice. Yeah. Our next baseball star signs it's Paul Goldschmidt. He is a Virgo. Ah, one of my favorites, Ryan Sandberg. A couple of them. There's a a couple Hall of Famers for you. Frank Thomas, Ryan Sandberg. Thomas made the Hall of Fame, right? Oh yeah, first ballot. Yeah, yeah, no doubt. Hard to keep track. Got guys like Harold Baines going in. Yeah. Got guys like Harold Baines going in, and then you got guys like well, the Greg Maddox had to wait till the second ballot. No, he just didn't get a unanimous. Oh yeah, a unanimous. He should have got. It. He should have got a unanimous. Greg Maddox might be the best ever. He's up there. I almost said Pokey Reese. <laughs> Pee Wee Reese. Uh, looks very different from Pokey Reese. Uh, that's my mistake. Reese Hoskins. Oh, no. That's, uh, we had a little one slide out on us. Nice and easy. It's the Suspetes. 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 Family barbecue. Like a podcast or something like that. It is. I think we saw one of these uh, in our yeah, blaster I've box. Of I've never listened to it, but I've heard of it. Uh, was it a, just a, just a regular? Yonder Alonzo. Another guy that started out with the Reds. Shane Bieber. He's having a good year, if I remember correctly. Yeah. And it's uh, another one of the Stallions collection. We saw some of these the other night. The Morgan Horse. Excellent. We got An Andrelton Simmons and Chipper Jones. Everybody loves Chipper Jones. We got two more hits. Yep. We're about a third of the way through. We had a nice Derek Rodriguez framed autograph, and we got two more hits in this box coming. So hopefully it's something pretty good. And speaking of Derek Rodriguez, there's this regular card. And it's the Boston Red Sox. Everyone looks like they're having a good time. Another Reese Hoskins. This one's the small version. He's an excellent player. And Miss Andrews, AJ Andrews. She is a softball player. Is that Trevor Hoffman? One of the best closers of all time. And incredible equipment. This time it's King Arthur's sword. Monty Python and the Holy Grail. If you haven't watched it. Oh, that's an awesome base card. Go watch it. This one right here. Yeah, that's sweet. That is absolutely beautiful. Hat around backwards. 24 chain. Might be the most perfect swing I've ever seen. Who had a better swing? Him, Ted Williams, Tony Gwynn? Who is it? They all had good ones. I don't think any of them was better than him, though. And it's Oz with a period. 
Mike Oz, oh, baseball yeah. card video host. Yeah, he does stuff on Yahoo. I've seen him. He's all right. Check out Oz on Yahoo. You said Yahoo? It gets baseball players and has them open up a pack of cards from like back when they were good. I've seen Pete Burry's on there. and nice. yeah, That's pretty cool. Does he tell them that? Here, I got a pack of cards from back when you were good. Yeah, he gives them like an <laughs> option. He'll give them like, well, he'll give them three years to pick from. And then they'll pick one and we'll talk about the players in it. Joey Gallo to start off this pack. Second time we've seen him. Jack Flaherty. And it's Rocks. Uh, sports agent and author, Burton Rocks. There you go for all you sport agent fans. Is that Frankie Robinson? Absolutely. Frank Robinson, incredible player. I got a Frank Robinson autograph baseball. How do you like that? Oh no. Marcel Ozuna up next. And look at that. Again, to greats this time, it's Johnny Bench, the greatest catcher of all time. If you do not agree, you are wrong. It's Matt Kemp in a red uniform. Everyone will remember his great stint as a Cincinnati red leg. Here you go, kids. Tony Gwynn, if you don't know who he is, Google him. He's one of the best ball players of all time. A little underrated, in my opinion. He should be talked about with guys like Ted Williams. And uh, it's awesome card with the, the fancy border there. My goodness. Talk for a second, Luke. I'm taking a drink of water. Uh, still got two hits left. Probably a probably coming up on a relic card or something. Hopefully it ain't something too ridiculous, but you got to kind of expect it. It was hilarious. We were doing a blaster box the other night on the Angry Box breaks, and... Before we got started, it looked like here's a couple horrible players that signed. I, I guarantee I'll get a Brad Radke, and he mentioned somebody else. But I'll be damned if we didn't pull that Brad Radke <laughs> autograph. It was pretty crazy. I wouldn't lie to you folks. That, I was stunned. I looked at him like, what? <laughs> Another Suspedes family barbecue card. This time it is the regular uh, Ryan Braun. Go to yeah, yeah, Ryan Braun. Yeah, he sucks. Blake Trennan up next, and it's Mark Summers. He signs, too. Does he? I think so, yeah. Oh, people my age will love Mark Summers. I don't know if the young kids will know who he is. He hosted a Double Dare, which was a fantastic, uh, what do you call it, like, a, game like an show. obstacle yeah, course an kind obstacle of game course. show. You get slime on your head and stuff. Sandy Koufax, baseball star signs. He was a Capricorn and certainly one of the most dominant pitchers of all time. Absolutely sick card. I like that one a lot. What do we got? Chugging along. It's a freight train card. There you go. Got to love Alan and Gunter. Chugging along. The first train in 1804 pulled 25 tons of iron. Sounds like a Johnny Cash song. Give that to your I'm little sure brother. Your little brother likes to drink. <laughs> Matt Scherzer up next. And it's uh, Mr. Martin again. This time it's this full-size card, the voice of Mario, making a second appearance. Appearance? Did I say appearance? Jesus. got to open it the opposite. You want to take over here, Mr. No, no, <laughs> Mr. Critic? It's like... <laughs> I've been at work today. It's, it's a hard day, man. Come home. And I'll open your baseball cards for you. Mr. Severino to start out that pack. Jake Arietta. Ah, uh, Stan Musial. Absolute beast. I can never remember Kingery. Scott Kingery. Another Philly fan. Xander Bogarts. Ah, and it's the short print version. Johnny Calls Sith. You're going to pull a Sith out of the pile. I guess it's worth looking at. 
According to stories created by George Fillinger in the 1950s, Kansas farmers owed their livelihoods to the Sith of Johnny Call. The giant, reputed to be bigger than even Paul Bunyan, could brandish his Sith to bring needed rain to the farms by lopping off tornado spouts. It also was said that he used it to help Pecos Bill dig the Grand Canyon. Johnny calls Sith. Sith or Scythe, Luke? I think it's a Sith. I don't know. I guess it depends on where you're from. Yeah, it might be regional. Scooter Jeanette, back healthy with the Reds. Hopefully, he'll finish up the year on a good note, second half of the year. And Louis Iorius, rookie card. Kikuchi to start off this pack. He's been good. Having a good rookie year. And uh, we saw him the other night. John Sin, signed Sin, World Series of Poker. And it's another aircraft card. This time you're looking at the. Uh, go ahead and try reading it yourself, folks. Have fun. So pretty, pretty artwork on those, though. I bet it looks cool put together. Mr. Porcello up next. And we have another hit. This time it's Dre Archer. Oh, Chris Archer. Chris Archer, I'm sorry. Who the hell's Dre Archer? <laughs> I think I'm a football player. <laughs> yep. I'm an idiot. His name is Chris Archer, of course. Star pitcher of the Pittsburgh Pirates. Patch card. Give you a good look at the patch. That is an absolutely beautiful card. What do you think, Luke? Yeah, it kind of sucks, but it's all right. <laughs> That's how it goes. All right. Yeah. Tough fucking crowd here. Yeah. Folks. Not bad, though. Quinn 92. Check out uh, our earlier Angry Box Breaks if you like him. We hit for a relic card of Quinn 92. It's pretty awesome. And Tino Martinez. How about that? Tino. About to do for a crazy hit. A crazy hit. We got one more hit left in the box. Hopefully it's a good one. See that Harrison Ford autograph. Yeah, that'd be sweet. Cody Bellinger having a hell of a year. What are you doing? Why why'd they decide to use that photo? <laughs> Look how goofy he looks there, Luke. Yeah, I've nice seen it. Byron Buxton up next. Oh no. Daniel Murphy. And it's Alkaline. His tiny card, just standard. Hell of a ball player. Alex Rodriguez up next. A Rod. And another Ginter Greats. This time it's Ken. Ken, my goodness. Cal Ripka Jr. Awesome. Go look up the one of one Justin Verlander break. It has an incredibly awesome Cal Ripken Jr. patch card in it. And, of course, the one-on-one -one Verlander sketch card it was a great break. Al Kiner, Ralph Kiner, pardon me, and Tyler O'Neill. Oh, that, was, that was sloppy. Well, we got A-Rod in the last one. And in this one, we get Derek Jeter, best buddy. Cole Hamill's up next. But we got the little one that fell out here. Collectible canines. It's the West Highland Terrier. Absolutely adorable. Little, little info on the West Highland Terrier for you there. He's a good boy. Cole Hamels. Justin Smoke. And what do we got? A surfer, a swimmer, Dreschel. 
American Ninja Warrior. I don't know him. We don't know him. He's got a goofy haircut. Tony Gwynn's baseball star signs. Awesome. And they put him in the one of the best uniforms oh, ever. Sweet uniform. Man, I'd like to get a Tony Gwynn jersey that year. He is a Taurus. I'm a Taurus. How about that? That's an awesome card right there. Catfish Hunter. Unfortunately, no mustache on him in this picture. You want to see an all-time mustache, Google up Catfish Hunter. And Andrew Benatendi. <coughs> Pardon me. This will bring us two-thirds of the way through our hobby box. We'll take a second and thank you for hanging out. Justin Verlander starts off this pack. We just mentioned him. Check out that one-on-one. It was so sweet. By Todd Aaron Smith, one of the best in the game. Ernie Banks. Incredible player. And it's Babe Ruth. You pulled one of these the other night, too, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. James Paxton up next. And Jim Palmer. <clears throat> An incredible pitcher. He doesn't get the credit he deserves. Nobody talks about Jim Palmer. Outstanding pitcher. Phil Rizzuto up next. Yankee great. And it's the Cleveland Bay Horse. Another one of the Mares and Stallions collection. And we're going to finish off that pack with a rookie card. It's Brad Keller. Don't forget, coming up, we do have our box topper as well. A little one's going to fall out on me here again. So we'll take a look at that. Ah, Eddie Murray. Incredible player for the Orioles. Finally got into the Hall of Fame, didn't he? A couple years oh, ago? Oh, yeah, he got in a while back. That's a, that's a I think he had to wait a couple years, though. Short print. Matt Carpenter. That's a short print? Yeah. Nice. Edwin Diaz. Yeah, nice. Ronald Acuna Jr. Outstanding player for the Braves. Bo Jackson, one of the greatest athletes of all time. No doubt about it. And it's the Concord. Another one of the aircraft collections. We got Todd Helton up next and Coynell Perez, rookie card. Do me a favor there. Let me slide that base stack off uh, somewhere or just make it shorter for me. Moving right along. Let's score the rest of the movie. Nine to two. Reds? Reds. My goodness. Ah, Max Muncy. You scored a Max Muncy autograph earlier this year, didn't you? Yeah, yeah I got, got one. Nice one. Framber Valdez, rookie card. I think he's going to have a good career. Yeah. Anthony Rizzo. One of the better home run hitters in the league. Man, I can't believe I forget all these first names as bad as I do. Victor Robles. Getting old, folks. My uh, memory ain't quite what it used to be. I apologize about some of these names. Buster Posey. Short print. Beautiful. I like that. George Brett. Ginter Greats Collection. Heck of a player. I can still picture in my head him running crazy out of the dugout. Javier Baez and Michael Kopech up next. A rookie card to finish off the pack. Another kid I like a lot. I think he's going to have a very good career. Out with Tommy John right now. 
the back. I don't know if he's the back this year or not. I don't think so. Hey, Luke and I grew up in an era where uh, something like that, and you were just done. You, you weren't pitching anymore, and if you did, you were going to be horrible. But now uh, these kids can come back a year later, and it's pretty impressive what they can accomplish after Tommy John these days. Brian Anderson starts off that pack. Juan Marichal, Hall of Famer. Harmon Killebrew, another Hall of Famer. Michael Bohr. <laughs> it was a goofy looking picture. I saw him uh, a couple of weeks ago. He's put on some weight. Yadier Molina. He is a cancer. Baseball star signs. He's one of those guys, if he's on your team, you like him, you love him. If he's not, if he's in your division, he's kind of a turd. The Ramon Laureano, and this one's numbered. You don't see a lot of numbered Allen and Ginter. Ramon Laureano, 23 of 25, hand numbered, it looks like, on the back of that card. A super short print, yeah. Super short print. Let me show it to you one more time. I'll make sure the. Make sure the, there you go. Take a good look. 23 of 25 hand number. That's going to go right into a penny sleeve. That's cool. Penny. That is. That's very cool. Don't see a lot of, when they say super short print, they ain't kidding. I've, I've seen a lot of those. Michael Brantley and Francisco Lindor. Excellent player. I wonder if that counts as a hit. Man, I would assume so. You think it's just an extra? I don't know. It might count as a hit. I don't, I don't know. We got a few more packs here. We're going to see if that counts as a hit or not. That's a pretty sweet card, though. Uh, Vayner? Vaynerchuk? <laughs> Let's see what Mr. Vaynerchuk's all about. He's an entrepreneur, Gary Vaynerchuk. The chairman of VaynerX, a modern-day media and communications holding company. There you go. Okay, it's a Brooklyn back. One in 264 packs. One in 264 packs. Our Ramon Laureano. Brooklyn back. They call it the Brooklyn back. I noticed it did say Brooklyn really big across the back. That makes sense. So that does make perfect sense. Beautiful. And another one here, Jake Arietta. Just a regular backed one there. Kiermaier, Kevin Kiermaier. Paul Goldschmidt up next. And Olympic champion Loretta Claiborne. A Special Olympics athlete. Awesome. Ma oh. Masahiro Tanaka. I hope I got that right. You were close. <laughs> Appaloosa, another Mare and Stallions card. And that Jose Abreu. As we get closer to the end, I'll thank you one more time for hanging out. I have a lot of fun with these. Put in the comments what you like, what you don't like, what breaks you want to see next. If you want to leave some feedback for the angry box breaks, tell us what you're angry about. We'll get it into a video. Give you a shout out. Up next, it's Patrick Corbin. And Tyler Kepner. A baseball writer. Nicholas Castellanos up next. And it's Chihuahuas. Collectible canines. <laughs> the Chihuahua. <laughs> I, until recently, had two Chihuahuas. And now, unfortunately, I have one Chihuahua. They're good dogs. 
another aircraft card. This time it is, oh, it's the same one as before. And right behind that, here we go, folks. It's another hit. Four hits. Rick Porcello. Jersey card. That is an absolutely beautiful patch. The Red Sox. Red. The Allen and Ginter insignia there. This is a genuine Allen and Ginter relic card. Rick Porcello. That really is a pretty patch. Make sure that goes in a penny sleeve. And Josh James is going to round out that pack. What do you think, Luke? That wasn't too bad. Pretty good box. He's got an autograph, so I've seen some boxes with no autograph. That's a framed autograph, too. It's a beautiful card. Yeah, it's nice. Nice color card. Ben Zobris to start us off. That Javi Vasquez. Felipe Vasquez, pardon me. Brooks Robinson. Aaron Nola. The Phillies have all kinds of young talent. <clears throat> Randy Johnson, one of my all-time favorites. One more time. And what a great box of Ginter greats you got in this one, Luke. It's Nolan Ryan this time. We've seen Johnny Bench. But all kinds of good Ginter greats in this one. Yeah. Randy Johnson, I think. Yeah, Randy. Starlin Castro down in Miami and Mariano Rivera. He was your first unanimous inductee into the Hall of Fame. Is that right? Yeah. That's wild. You telling me Ken Griffey Jr., Cal Ripken Jr., Wade Boggs, you're telling me these guys aren't first ballot or unanimous decision? Yeah, it was silly. Maybe. Maybe you'll see more unanimous decisions now. Maybe that opened it up. Jason Veritek to start off that pack. Jorge Alfaro. And Josh Hader in Milwaukee. And it's Doc Gooden. For all you Mets fans, maybe we'll get a Daryl Strawberry by the end of this, too. Dale Murphy. Daniel Murphy, pardon me. And that's another one of the Allen and Ginter back insignia things there. Oh, we found a short print. Our Victor Robles, Robles was a short print. Juan Soto is your next baseball star of signs. He is a Scorpio. Kyle Seeger up next. Corey Seeger. Jeez, old Pete. Who's Kyle Seeger? And Noah Sindergaard. Beautiful set of hair. On Noah Sendergaard. <laughs> and that'll bring us to our last pack. You got the three big hits there, four big hits. Yeah. We'll give them a quick recap here in a second. Ah, uh, Ted Williams. Did you get a Ted Williams last time? I don't remember. I don't. One of my absolute favorite. Players love Ted Williams. Kyle Snyder, freestyle wrestler. Wrestling. That's a regular backed one. Aaron Nola one more time. We just saw his little version. And a Travis Pastrana. Awesome. Carlos Correa up next. Outstanding player. Another Mares and Stallions. This time it's the Andalusian. That's a pretty horse. Whit Merrifield and Michael Conforto is going to finish off the box. As always, we appreciate you hanging out. I am the Preston 13 here with Preston Sports. A good look at those. The Rick Parcello. The framed autograph, Derek Rodriguez, Chris Archer, Vlad Guerrero Jr. rookie, and our 23 of 25 Brooklyn card. 
awesome. All in all, pretty good box. I like that one a lot. And Allen Ginter products are always a ton of fun. Give me that box over there real quick. As I thank you one last time, I'll show you we got this guy coming up shortly. So please do stay tuned for that. I am the Preston 13. Be good, have fun, and I will see you next time.